Bonina Brown, and we are back with another crazy review. And no, I'm not auditioning for Pornhub. Sorry about it. So I am like the old women that sit back and watch QVC and like orders everything to see if it works. I've been on social media a lot and I've been seeing different things from wigs to makeup to underwear. And I'm like, I want to try these things and see if they actually do what they're supposed to do. With that said, I ordered from a company called Rounder Bum. They say bum, so I assume they're from like the UK or the Australia area because up here we say ass, honey, ass, yes. So Rounder Bum is a company that specializes in padding underwear and shirts for men who want to have more of a illusion and more of a umph because even though I love my slim little body, like sometimes I'm like, I want to be a little, little, like, look at my ass. Look, look at it. Where, where is it? Where is it? Where is it? What ass? What ass? Look, look. Oh. Is it moving? Is it moving? I know it's moving. I feel it in my heart. Like, even to do that was a struggle. Like, I literally broke a sweat. I'm over it. And let's be real, in order for people to take you serious, you have to look a certain way. Because obviously, if I had more muscles, then I would have been a fan favorite on Drag Race. No shade, no tea. Um, plus, you know, I want to look like Lee Dawson. Minus the ears. Yeah. So, let me show you the actual product because I've already opened it. So, let's see. This is the shirt. Yes. The shirt has padding installed in it, in the chest area, the shoulder, and the bicep. It looks a little like cartoony. I'm like, this is gonna look a mess, so I'm a little skeptical about this, but we shall see. Here goes the underwear in, you know, nice, cute, scratchable underwear. Here goes the padding in the back of it here. It looks like, oh my God, I don't know how this is going to look, so. We shall see, and it has instructions. Stop looking at my ass. Oh. Okay, so instructions one, put on the garment, considering the backside padding towards your buttocks and the front towards your abs. I mean, who wears backwards underwear, but okay. Remember that the fabric stretches enough in order to adapt to your body shape. Two, once the garment is worn, pull up to the waist, sides, and lower part so that it adjusts to your body and the padding sits in the middle of your buttocks. So, wow. Oh, let me read it for my Spanish fans in the language. Instrucciones de uso uno. Cocolate la prenda tomando en cuente la parte pastilla relenos hacia las glutos while la parte frontal hacia el abdomen. Recuerdo cuotala estara los sensibencias para armadas a tu corporo. Yeah. So I ordered mine in small, and it looks a little small, but it's supposed to stretch. So if you are a little bigger than me, I would say get a medium or a large, to be honest. So let's just put this on and let's see what happens. I'll be RB. OMG, okay, I'm actually pleasantly surprised. I was very skeptical, but this is kind of giving me that illusion I was hoping for. Like, I don't know if you guys see it, but I see it. It's not even like overly too big. Like, it actually complements my body size. So I'm a little surprised. And it gave me a badonka donk. Look at me. Say you like Sally, but don't ka donk. Like, oh my. Look, 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 look. Oh my God. Like, this is actually pretty good. I'm really surprised. Um,. And the thing is, what I love about it is that it gives you that upper, like, stance that you should have anyway as a confident human being. When I'm not wearing this, I'm kind of like, ooh. So, I'm really surprised with this. Rounder bum, y'all did that. Y'all did that. So, what we're going to do is put it to the test, put on the actual outfit, and see how it holds up underneath an outfit. And if it still gives that illusion. So, be right back. I'm about to go do that thing. Oh, y'all know that thing that thing okay so we are back and i must say it's still doing what it's supposed to do like i didn't put on nothing too major just something comfortable some sweats a long john shirt you know when you go meet trade that kind of outfit all i need are my nike flaps yes but anyway 
it feels good. And I will say it still has that illusion that I have an ass in the back. Oh, yeah. Just don't take me swimming on the first date. Okay. Um, I like this. And the sad part is now I'm like, oh, my God, I want to work. It inspired me to actually want to work out and get this kind of body. But then I sacrificed a lot for my drag as far as I sacrificed my boy self because for me, my female illusion, when I do it, I want to always give curves and a small frame. If you want to be a muscular queen, do you, but that's not me. So I feel like I don't want to get muscular because I don't want to be like, Scroll down the runway, another payday, cover of magazines. Like, no, <laughs> that's not for me, I'm sorry. And the other sad part is, is that a lot of people will probably see me now and be like, ooh, you sexy. Oh, I want him for this. But they don't like the person that's underneath all of this. Like, so many guys I know get beards and things and females get bigger titties because, you know, we want to look better in other people's eyes and ourselves when you really should love the skin that you are in. But with that being said, if you want to enhance and update your look and how you look, then there is nothing wrong with that. But as long as you know that underneath that, you are still beautiful. Oh, and now I see why the guys say, no fat, no fems. JK, JK. <laughs> if you do want to purchase this, it's rounder bum. You can go to them, purchase this. and But just know that still, if you buy this, that the person that's wearing it is still just as beautiful. So don't let nobody tell you different. And with that being said, stay beat, stay beautiful, and stay blessed. And I will catch you the next time.